Now that the boys season 4 has finally finished, it hit me once again. The 7 never has 7 members, or when it does, it doesn't last for long. How could Vought lie to me like this? I trusted them, so I set out to find every member that had joined or left the 7, to get a definitive answer as to whether the 7 should be called Homelander's Doom Platoon. The very original lineup of the 7 before the events of Season 1 takes place is Homelander, Queen Maeve, Black Noir, Mr. Marathon, Lamplighter, Translucent and The Deep. At some point before the start of the show, Mr. Marathon leaves and is replaced by the A-Train. This then leads to the events of Season 1, where we see in the very first episode that Starlight has been recruited to replace Landblighter after he was forced to resign by Stan Edgar. Huey then meets Billy Butcher after the death of his girlfriend Robin, and the two fight and stick a bomb up Translucent's butt, causing him to explode. Meaning as of the first episode of the show, the 7 is now down to the 6. Then later in Season 1, the Deep is exposed by Starlight for flashing her when she joined the team, and a whole bunch of other SA cases are opened up, and the Deep is forced to leave. You could say he found himself in it. Deep situation. Okay, I'll see myself out. But hit the subscribe button if you love the boys. So now we are down to 5, but the A train then suffers a heart attack after overdosing from too much compound V and ends up being useless anyway for 2 seasons. So it's actually down to 4 now. At the start of season 2, we finally have a new member join the 7 since Starlight joined all the way back in season 1 episode 1, and that is Blindspot. You thought I was going to say Stormfront, didn't you? But originally, Blindspot was hired by Ashley as a diversity hire, but Homelander then rejects him since he, and I quote, doesn't want a cripple in the 7. Um, I don't know. I do this. You didn't see that coming? So then we get Stormfront, who has been called to replace Translucent after Vought covers up his death as a heroic sacrifice. So the total is now back up to 6, but remember, A-Train is still unavailable, and Starlight does get imprisoned, so it's actually down to 4. A-Train was about to get replaced by Shockwave, but he gets his head popped by Newman in Washington, and Stormfront also gets exposed for being a Nazi, and Vought kick her off the team, much to Homelander's dismay. The Church of the Collective then meet up with Stan Edgar, who allows A-Train to join, but, <coughs> deep. but since A-Train still can't use his powers and Stormfront is badly beaten by Ryan after facing the boys. This leaves the total at the end of Season 2 to be 4. Season 3 begins with Starlight becoming the new co-captain of the 7. Homelander then forces Vought to bring back the Deep, and now the 7 is back to having 6 members, and the final member of the 7 gets chosen from the reality show and he ends up being supersonic. However, that lasts about a day, because Homelander then brutally rips him apart for staging a coup with Starlight. After the events of Herogasm, Starlight then exposes Homelander on a live stream and publicly resigns her role from the 7, making the total back down to 5. Homelander then kills Black Noir, bringing the total down to 4, and Maeve sacrifices herself to stop Soldier Boy in the finale of Season 3, bringing the total down to 3, but she isn't dead, just has no powers. This leaves the remaining members at the end of Season 3 to be Homelander, A-Train, and The Deep. Now from here on out, there will be spoilers for Season 4, so come back after you have watched it. It's all on Amazon Prime. Go watch it. In Season 4, we see two new members join the 7. Homelander hires Sister Sage, the smartest person alive, to help him create an empire for Ryan. She doesn't want to join the 7, but is forced to anyways, bringing the total back up to 4. Sister Sage then hires Firecracker as a way of sparking conflict between the Starlighters and Homelander's homies. So now we have 5. It also turns out that Vought and Homelander have covered up Noir's death by simply getting another narcoleptic soup to play and he becomes best friends with the Deep, bringing the total back up to 6. A-Train finally does something this season and after being bedridden for 2 seasons he finally goes on the redemption arc that we all wanted him to go on and he ends up leaking information about Homelander's master plan to the boys. This leads to A-Train currently being on the run and also leaving the 7 for good so the total is now back down to 5 and Sage also gets fired by Homelander after suffering brain damage courtesy of MM so currently the members of the 7 are Homelander, the Deep, Black Noir 2.0 and Firecracker leaving the current total to be before, but it is unclear if Sage is hired again because apparently this was all part of a master plan and Firecracker might die soon so who knows. But I feel as though from this point on, the 7 is relevant since Homelander has now supreme control of the US government so he doesn't need a 7, he just needs the one, that one being Billy Butcher. Comment below your thoughts and subscribe whilst you're there.